how many people can you gather in one room such that everyone knows everyone else before they even step foot into the room. So no connections can happen inside the room, but everyone should know everyone else before they step into the room. So we have 8 billion people. The number I estimate, it's probably around 50 to 100 people, depending on the definition, know each other. We can draw all 8 billion people and all of the connections we are going to represent by edges. For example, these two know each other, these two know each other, these two know each other, like that. But we are looking for the maximum amount of people such that everyone knows everyone else. And this is called a max click. So a maximum click of four vertices will look something like this. If I add a five ver fifth vertex here, you have to connect it to everyone else without an exception. Okay? And now if I add a six vertex, it's already very hard. It's extremely hard to connect it with all, with all other vertices. That's why even in random graphs, the maximum click is very small. We can prove that it's somewhere in the logarithmic factor of the, of the, pe of the people. And, and, and I will say exactly, I will first introduce something called, so it's very different from, from, the, from uh, our graph of 8 billion people because in our graph of 8 billion people there are clusters and these clusters actually make it really hard to estimate such um, the, the, the maximum, the size of the maximum click, okay? But, but what is very interesting is so let's say we have n vertices and n is 10. And if for every pair of these vertices, so for let's say this one and this one, for every pair of these vertices, I have some probability of p that there will be an edge between these vertices. Maybe there won't. Uh, so so the p here, this probability ranges from, from 0 to 1, right? But this, is, this should be equal for every edge. And this is what er Erdos um, Renyi uh, graphs are made, uh, are how they are made. So we're fixing some number of vertices and then we're for each pair, we, we, are, we have some probability there will be an edge. So maybe there he here is an edge, maybe here is an edge, maybe here, 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 let's say like this, then there is maybe here there is like this an edge and then like that. And then these are random. So, so these with some probability. There is a theorem. If we have a graph G that we can de define by this n and p, so this what we said, the number uh, of vertices and the probability that there is an edge between a pair, the size of the maximum click, if p is uh, one half, is somewhere in the realm of two, two times one plus minus some constant here, some constant, we don't know what that constant, it depends on the, on the graph, it depends on many factors, but, but we, can pretty sure be, uh, we can be pretty sure that this is only a constant times the log 2 of n. So if n is very big, this is very small. And it's, if n is very big here, it's like, let's say n is 10 to the 6, so we have 10 to the 6 vertices, it's, we claim the size of the maximum click, the size of the maximum click, so we claim that the size of the maximum click of Gn is somewhere in the realm of all of log n. If we estimate that there are 8 billion people and there is a random probability of one half which is not even close, right? But if, it, if, it, if that's uh, it, that's... Uh, there will be like around 32, uh, the size of the max click will be around 32 people. But of course we know that that's not true because of the clustering. The clustering makes the probability higher in some areas, in some areas and lower in others. So if you imagine people that are living closer together in one family will know each other much tighter, so which will create much, uh, many more edges 
and the, the, the maximum click in this subgraph will be huge, right? But if I, if I just, just look at connections between uh, communities of people, so if I, I go on, a, on the, the world stage and I say how many people know each other where like, they live in separate countries, now these graphs are much more sparser. And in these graphs, the maximum click is lower. But if we combine both of these ideas, the clustering and this global connectivity, we can maybe possibly say that the maximum click is around uh, probably 100 people, if we are lucky, really. I don't know.